ready to fight. Ready. So a nice mix of finishes for Valentina Shevchenko and MMA Pro dating to 2003. Known primarily as a striker and a good counter striker at that, but very opportunistic when it comes to the submissions. Juliana Pena can attest to that. Shevchenko could secure a seventh career win by submission tonight. DC, I know you got my back. She's got her back. Well, she's on her back. We'll see if she can set up that rear naked choke. Oh, great submission defense as she gets out. Shevchenko's in half court. Nicely done. So look at this, DC. She's got her in rubber guard. I know we've seen a lot of Eddie Bravo pupils employ this with pretty good success in the UFC. What are you trying to do, though, here if you're that far? If I'm in the rubber... Oh, she's going for a submission now. She's so good here, John. Oh, compromising spot. Attack and all bar. Oh, she got out. How good is that? All right, so she's able to work her way back to her feet now. Oh, her striking looks good. She's got that single collar in the clinch now. Oh, how is she standing? Brutal knee to the body. Man, these knees are really starting to do a lot of damage to her opponent. And there is another one right on cue. So several knees landed already in this round. Oh, nice double leg, yes. Oh, right into mount. Way to kick her off and try to get some space to get up. She got that kick to the body home. That's a big hook. Oh, knee strike right to the body. Man, one knee after the next by her tonight. She certainly got that part of her game working. It's such a damaging strike for her to land this many knees. It's insane. What a nasty kick. That was thrown with ill intent. Oh, look at that. Caught the kick and takes her to the dump. Puts her right on her back. Great job running her feet, dumping her opponent through her butt on the takedown attempt off that nice kick. Postures up now and lands a devastating strike to the head. She does a good job of recognizing that the shots are coming, and she's got to get out of the way. Shevchenko gets back up again. Well, I think if I was a fighter, I'd probably be a headhunter, but she is not that, right? She's invested in the body, and she's done some pretty significant damage to her opponent. Absolutely. You know, you start to go there, and you land something, and you may think, wow, that was hard. Your opponent doesn't really respond. But as you start to pile them up on them, you start to see exactly what we're seeing right now. And now she can start to capitalize on that. 20 seconds to go in round one. Well, we told you off the top of offensive wrestling was off the charts. She gets another takedown there. Now we'll see what she can do. Now she looks to try and control her opponent because she's got the turn of takedown, oh, and it's awesome to see. But at some point, she needs to get some ground control if she truly wants to wear down her opponent. Get it back. You're better than she is. We need you to All right, let's check out some of the action now. You ready to fight? You ready? Let's do it. All right, round two. And there's a takedown attempt. Beautiful straight right hand. She continues to land to the body, attacking those organs, right? Not a lot of protection there, and you're seeing some visible damage now on the other side. Visible damage. She's done a tremendous job understanding and recognizing where the weakness was. There it is again. Look at it. Oh, big knee to the body. Oh! Massive shot land. It's over, John. Fight's done. Well, she gets back up here, but she is on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, huge connection by her there. Lower the curtain. Bring the cast out. Bring the cast out. Take the foul. The night folks. Oh, oh she made that oh, one count. Oh.
Well, there is going to be no denying her now. A huge TKO result here tonight, and this crowd is letting her know. John, you know how much I love to talk, and I'm sitting here almost speechless because this young lady looked amazing. She said she was going to get a finish, and that's exactly what she did. Wow. All right, Bruce Buffer.